Maghreb, my beloved Shahzadi, I fear my time is short and I must secure the realm. <clears throat> my loyal advisor, Maghreb, you have long served our people as their vizier, and I can think of no other to fill your shoes as well. Thank you, my Sultan. My only wish is to continue to serve our people. And so you shall. Maghreb, you shall continue your role as most wise and trusted counselor. Upon my death, Princess Shahzadi shall rule as Sultana of Baghdad. Allah's will be done. No! No! no. It is my turn! It is my right! No, no woman has ever led our people. It would be, it would be an abomination. <laughs> it is my wish and my command. Shahzadi has proven her worth and our commitment to our people. Times change. She has earned the right to rule in my stead. So it shall be. This, this is sacrilege. <sighs> Oh, it can be a, a trifle troublesome, but my daughter, you will manage. Nabil, come here, sit down. I'm watching learn my little best. By the power given to me by the Dark One. I command you to come to me. shall brave the cave alone. Then we shall see who sits on top of the throne as Sultan. <laughs> My father's favorite garden. Hmm. It is fitting that we honor his memory on this day. It is. For only here, we will find flowers that match your beauty, your highness. <laughs> I've already forgiven your outburst in my father's chambers. And I am grateful. But my sentiments, they are sincere, your highness. Flowery flattery, vizier. Honest praise. And today, I am just a bit. Yes. It's nice to loosen the restraints of office once in a while, is it not? Yes, it is. Perhaps we can do this more often. There's time. Look, there! I love acrobats. Mindless little monkey. Baghdad was supposed to be generous. I just got here. Give him time. A city in celebration is a city with money. And now I'm certain some will find its way into our hands.
to reward that young man. Indeed. Most impressive. Thank you. All in a day's work, my friend. Oh, uh, speaking of which, eh? I was in the middle of mine when all this happened, so, you know, perhaps you could see your way to. Are you suggesting I pay you for doing me a favor? The Quran says, do good deeds and the rewards of paradise await. But in the meantime. In the meantime? I don't recall reading that part. Well, it certainly ought to be in there, don't you think? No. Um. Unhand me! Uh, a mistake. It's not at all what it looks like. Fairly sure it's exactly what it looks like. But not my concern. Someone wishes to have a word with you. My fortune has seemed to change. Your capture of the thief was most impressive. What is your name, acrobat? Aladdin. Forgive me, I did not hear you. Aladdin, my lady. You may approach, Aladdin. <laughs> I don't buy Aladdin. Come here. Please. This charm has been in my family for many years. It has protected me from evil. And now it shall protect you. It is too much, my lady. He's most certainly right. It's far too much, Your Highness. Your bravery deserves reward. And I want you to have this. A pleasure to meet you. Acrobats. <laughs> what just happened? Do you honestly not know? Allah hath given him eyes, yet he doth not see. Stop that. We're what? not a holy man. Words of the righteous may fall from many. Aladdin, do you not know why the city is celebrating today? One sultan goes, another sultan comes. What of it? Not sultan. Sultana. Yes, you fool. You just met the ruler of Baghdad. Wait, what? How could I miss that? Well, perhaps the charms on her wrist weren't the only charms you're focused on. I was thinking that myself. I was thinking she seemed to like acrobat Aladdin. <laughs> I was thinking that myself too. Yeah. You're both bad. No, she was. She was merely toying with a peasant. <laughs> Peasants don't give silver gifts. Deeper currents run in this river. Allah hath said. Stop, Stop it. it. My friends, give me a moment to gather my thoughts. I'll be back. Hmm. I assume by now you know who I am. Greetings, Vizier. Well met, Acrobat. Aladdin. You know, the palace could use a man like you, with such skills and talents, acrobat. I've already received my payment from the palace. A man such as yourself does not work for charity. A man such as me. A real man earns his way. 
I offer a task, and the payment is far greater than the reward. <laughs> what could be worth more than that? Perhaps an invitation to an audience with the... Sultana. The Sultana? Mm. Why does she who needs you? A man with your talents and skills, young man. An acrobat, it seems. Just so, just so. Assist me in completing this task, and I shall promptly escort you to the palace, where you can pick up where you left off. <laughs> she saw a very brave and resourceful young man today, one that certainly piqued her interest. Now come, we must reach our destination before the moon is full. <laughs> uh, my friends, they need me. <sighs> our it act, Sultana needs you and she awaits our return now come you must leave at once first he's flirting with princesses now he's riding with royalty are viziers royal do they arrest you for flirting he doesn't look arrested. He doesn't look happy either. Something is going on. When Allah directs a strong wind, a man must sail that course. Guys, we gotta go grab horses and follow, follow them, our greed. Truly a desolate wasteland. I, I thought there was nothing out here. The desert holds many, many secrets, acrobat. Aladdin. My name is Aladdin. <laughs> Names and titles are interchangeable and unimportant, I say. So, Vizier, what do you require of me? Oh. Vessel, vessel, boy. The will of Allah runs through me. I am but a holy man carrying out his will. What does he wish? Mm -hmm. Inside, there is a caravan of treasure. A cachet of wealth that has been carried down from Sultan to Sultan since time immemorial. I always wondered where the money came from. There's a lack. And it represents the Sultana's right to rule. We must retrieve the lamp, bring it to her immediately so that she may bless it, then we return the lamp so it will await its next eventual ruler. There are obstacles inside the cave, and unfortunately, I am too old and beat up to contend with them, so. Now, this staff will light your way, and this rope will help you with said obstacles. Simply unwind it and place it in any hole you come across and let it go. It will drop. You must return before moonset, for that is when the cave will close and I will be unable to open it until the next full moon. I will have some tales to tell the Sultan when we return. Yes, yes, yes. Yes, you shall. Now, here, here, please. Let it go and drop. By the prophet.
Every new sultan the vizier makes this trip. Again with the fire. Spent a lifetime trying to find the real lamp. Apparently, someone did. The light of knowledge destroys the darkness of ignorance. Where's Aladdin? Shh. We'll follow his tracks back after he passes. Then we need to go now. This makes you sultan?
There. Look. Like a well-thrown dart in the game of chance, the hand of Allah has guided our steps. Thank you, all wise one. Enough. Aladdin needs us. Alas, our friend is entombed. We're too late. Already I miss him. Already I missed the 30 drachma he owed me. It was only 20! Prophet! Climbing! <laughs> I knew you were alive. Try to tell him. <laughs> First you were enslaved and then entombed. How comes this? I was entombed but not enslaved somehow. What of the vizier? It is a story long in the telling, my friends. Then start it properly at the beginning. The lamp still evades us, my little pet. But I will be Sultan, and Shazadi will be my bride. At moonrise, I retrieve what is mine. And then, I catapulted out of the cave and into your arms. Tell me again about the special lamp. It's a symbol of the Sultan's right to rule. The new Sultan or Sultana must bless it and then it must be returned to the cave. I've never heard of such a thing. And I've lived in Baghdad my whole life. <laughs> oh, 22 years of it. <laughs> I agree. There's something more below the surface here. Well, let's have a look at the wellspring of all these woes. Well, it's definitely a lamp. Okay. It's an ordinary lamp. Why would there be so many traps guarding it? Who knows why royals do anything they do? But I if once it's heard... worth something to the vizier, then it's worth something to us. We could sell it. I don't know. We used the last of our coins on the horses. And I don't think the vizier is going to be paying you anytime soon. Hmm. Perhaps you could sell the charm. I'll clean up the lamp, and we'll sell it. Oh, I still think there's something special about that lamp. I am the genie of the lamp. Thou hast summoned me. Why doest thou hide, O oh master? Rise, so I may serve thee. Uh, forgive me, I... I didn't summon thee, uh... Thou didst summon me, from the lamp. I told you it was special. <gasps> so that's why the vizier wanted the lamp. That coward! He sent you to brave the traps that he should have braved himself. He is so unworthy. Does that make me worthy? Worthy of being the Vizier's lamp lackey. Yes. You've done well to tell me these things, mortal. Mortal. <laughs> You're real. A genie. Magic is real. I appeared out of a lamp in a puff of smoke. Was that nothing to you? Actually, it was when the Vizier opened up the magic cave. The Vizier consorts with the Dark Ones. You must avoid him at all cost. That will be difficult. Uh, you see, he stands between me and uh, a woman I've met. Ah, now that is more to my liking. Romance is my specialty. So... Who is this woman? A woman out of his league. A woman I dare not romance. Romance? That's what started the entire mess. Imagined romance. Oh, friends of my master. Do you doubt my master's affections? Did he just call you his master again? He who summons me rules me. <laughs> I have a genie. <laughs> Wait, wait, wait. How does this work? 
What do you desire? If I were to be honest, at this moment, a hot meal. <laughs> a feast? For you and your friends? Why not? Yeah. Try not to overseason the mutton, if you would. Hmm. Oh, you I, I was jesting. Well, your stomach said otherwise, Master. Sorcery! Genie. Now sit, enjoy. Come on, come on, come on. It wasn't the heavens above, your smile was just in disguise, and my purse disappeared with your love. Your love! Your love! How do you know all our songs? Genie! Oh. <laughs> 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 oh. Hey! <laughs> that stench is worse than a dead camel's backside. <laughs> Excuse me. Well, truly this genie can give you whatever your heart desires. Indeed I can, Master. I have all that I could ever need. I have you, my good friends. More to me is family. I have my health. Our life is pleasant. I lack for nothing. There is nothing missing. If I'm to be honest, the only thing missing would be love. And Shazadi is the only piece that would make the puzzle of my life complete. Shazadi? <laughs> She can be yours! Alas, I am unworthy. She is Sultana. And I am nothing but a street performer. A commoner. A peasant. A pleb. A rude. <laughs> Laborer. Sir, fool. <laughs> okay, well, ouch. <laughs> <laughs> well, I see what your problem is, Aladdin. You two need to be equals. I shall make her a peasant. No, 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 no. <laughs> oh, I can't make that decision for her. I... If I were a prince, well, then she could consider me. Well, I can make you a prince. <laughs> Either way works for me. Mortals choose their own paths. I merely assist. How do you get to be a genie? You know, where do you come from? We're born to it. Slaves of the mystic lamp. And the power therein. You and the lamp are one? If the lamp were to be sundered, I would be my own man. But as long as it remains whole, I'm forever bound to it. So you have no parents? No sisters, brother? I am as you see me. What's your name? My name. In <laughs> 10,000 years, and endless masters, no one has ever asked me that before. <laughs> I like knowing the names of my friends. Nor has anyone called me that either. <laughs> <sighs> then it's time we change that. I am Aladdin. Aladdin? Well. My name is far too long and too difficult for you to say. <laughs> so you may call me friend. Though I am partial to the name Merit. Wish come true. Exactly. Now, back to matters at hand. If a prince you wish to be, then appropriate raiment is an order. Stand up. Up, 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 up. Come on. look a little out of date fashion wise because it has been a minute since I've seen what's current your clothes you look like a prince see I told you my fashion sense was good I think the Sultana 
will still recognize Acrobat Aladdin? <laughs> Easily rectified. It's <laughs> impressive. Oh Allah himself would not recognize him. Allah sees past the wrapping to the gift, but then. The wrapping has more value than the gift. What are you all on about? You're still the same, Master. Except everyone else sees a different you. I'm not sure I want to be a different you. Just what's inside you that never changes. She will love the real you, rest assured. There's still something missing. Stand back! This will be the end all be all. Uh, well, well, what does that even mean? Ah! <laughs> words right out of my mouth, brother. My master, I believe this meets the criteria that you commanded. <laughs> I suppose it will suffice. Suffice? <laughs> By the beard of the prophet! <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry, Murat. I, I just wanted to see what you'd do if a wish went wrong. Well, my wishes never go wrong. <laughs> oh, darling, I certainly can't find fault with this. She'll never see it. She's never left Baghdad. Well, guess what? Well, I will bring the Sultana here. No, 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 no. No, no, no. No magic. We'll, we'll invite her. She should come to me on her own. Okay, Master, as you command. It is nice to leave the worries of the palace behind, even for a moment, yes? They are, unfortunately, never far behind. Well, perhaps the burdens of office are far too much for one person to handle alone. That is why I have you, my vizier. Well, perhaps I could mean more to you than just Bazir Shazadi. If only... Uh, Sultana, I bring a message from a courier. A courier? You may rise. A courier from whom? I don't know, my lady. But he rode upon a beautiful white horse. His Royal Highness, Prince Ali Ababa extends his congratulations to his royal neighbor and invites Her Majesty to attend a feast in her honor. Who is Ali Ababa? I know of no such royal family by that name, Your Highness. Nonetheless, we shall attend. Ah, she's here, Master. She'll enter in moments. I am ready to receive them. Not quite. Your friends must not be seen, or else all will be undone. Wait, what? Regrets. They have all the best food in their rooms, Master. 
Very well. That was one of two concerns. Correct. Now you, my handsome fellow, need to make an entrance. Indeed. How have we not known such wealth? How have I not known of this wealth? <laughs> Where is our host? Delighted to meet you. Greetings and felicitations, exalted guests. Welcome to my humble home, Your Majesty. Humble. Thank you, Your Highness. May I introduce my most trusted vizier, Maghreb Ashad al -Badur. Your invitation is most gracious, Your Highness. Your, uh... Home. <laughs> it's quite lovely. Greetings to you, Maghreb. Please, permit me the honor of giving you a small tour before we dine. The honor and pleasure would be ours, Your Highness. I would be honored if you would call me Ali, Your Majesty. Treats me like a little sister. You have known each other your whole lives. It's hard for him to see you as anything else. She doesn't have anything that I don't have. But we know each other. I know him more than he knows himself. If you did, you would see what's in his heart now. Chef, Prince Ali. The variety of dishes you served was amazing. I did not know the names of half of them. <laughs> Neither did I. Oh? My, uh... My chef is relatively new to this region. This is a pleasant diversion. Your garden is lovely. You mean you cheated again? You wound me. Was there ever a man more misunderstood? No, I understand you're fine, you bully-headed rascal. Uh, this time you've gone too far. Uh, Tamper! It is for magic money! It's a principle! Uh, it's always the honest man that suffers! Your garden is truly remarkable, Prince Ali. Please. Just Ali. Never have I seen such lush growth before. Such unusual trees. My gardener called it a forest. I love gardens. As do I. As a youth, I would sit in the trees, barefoot, and play the flute. I was never allowed to climb a tree. Mm. Rules, rituals, restrictions. Such is our life. 
You should never be afraid to break a rule. If it means a little happiness. Happiness is hard to come by when you rule a kingdom. You know this. I know I yearn for a life that is more than just ruling. Your home is truly beautiful, Prince Ali. Made even more so by your presence, Your Highness. <laughs> Please, no flattery. I get my fill of it at home. Every royal does. But surely you have learned to tell the difference between false and real? I seem to have missed that lesson. Allow me to share the chapter you skipped, my lady. Were the stars themselves to drop from the heavens, they could not match the sparkle in your eyes. <laughs> <laughs> Even the dimmest village girl would not fall for that. <laughs> <laughs> The sound of your laughter is like unto sweet music and gladdens my heart. That is better. Your hands are as warm as your smile. They are merely hands. They tremble, as does your heart. I think I've learned the lesson, Prince Ali. You're a quick study. I have a good teacher. <laughs> and what has the student learned? It's the eyes. The mouth may speak, but the eyes speak the truth. Then you know the truth of the matter regarding me. Your Highness! Come join me. <laughs> Prince Ali, I... I couldn't. Uh, uh, uh. My garden, my rules, and... There are none. Come, I'll help you out. My mother used to say, Aaliyah, my heart, time for bed. The moon will be back tomorrow. Alia. My middle name. <laughs> Father named me Shazadi because I was the princess in his life. Not just by office. But my mother named me Alia. Thank you, Prince Ali. Who should I say Aladdin? The eyes! The acrobat! Yes, my dear. He has deceived us all into believing that he was a real prince. But the palace! The garden! All magic! Let her go, Magrab. Magic! The home. Thou hast summoned me, master. 
command me. Vinny, I quite like this palace. Move it to your mountain trap there. I shall rule from there as Sultan. With my new bride, of course. No! <laughs> Genie, take all that I now possess to my new home. Thank you, fool. Enjoy your return to poverty. Shall we? I knew it was too good to last. Aladdin, what happened? The vizier happened. And that's where we have to go, to set it right. How will we get there? We have no horses, no camels, no genie. Merkrab took everything. And we will get it back. How? We have no weapons. No magic. We have each other. He has a genie. We should leave while we can. He may not spare us when we next meet. Aladdin, this is a sign. A sign that we have no business concerning with royalties. Their concerns are not ours! In the heavens, we all look the same. We just follow different paths. So a wicked man in power doesn't concern us? All of this happened because of me. It's mine to undo. I'm with you, Aladdin. As am I. When a man stretcheth out his hand, his brother may not refuse. Or his sister. I'll go. But only because you lot can barely tie your sashes without me. Where the radiance from your cheeks shames even the moon and stars in the retreat. <laughs> what do you want, Vizier? It is Sultan to you, my lamb. I am not your lamb. <sighs> Genie, my betrothed needs proper raiment. As thy command, master. Ah, ever more lovely. Genie, you may go. I will never marry you, Vizier! Mm. Your venom stings, but I shall pull your fangs soon enough. Now prepare yourself, Elia. Unless we find more. There should be more up ahead, by the mountain. It is so hot already. I don't think we can make it that far. Aladdin, we're still close enough to Baghdad. Let us return. Grab supplies at least. No, we don't have time. We don't know what Magreb's planning. We must move forward. To be honest, I'm not in such a hurry to meet up with a wicked man wielding a genie. So what? I don't know what fate awaits us. Take courage, brother. You will make this right. For the die for a lie. Even the vizier spoke with a little wisdom. He said it is never sad to embrace your destiny. Sorcery. A little help? 
Your Highness. The Rish would have something lofty to say if he were here now. If we weren't here, he would be here. It's happening again. Get under cover. He commanded to see, Master. Uh, lands. Beyond lands. Vast oceans. There must be sights and marvels to behold. Ooh, indeed, Master. What thou carest to see a volcano up close? It's truly a wondrous thing to see firsthand. Thou only need a wish. Hmm? A mm -hmm. volcano. What, what is a volcano? Never mind. Perhaps you can tell me later. For now, I wish to hear more about these distant lands and who dwells there and all the gold that they possess. <laughs> As you wish, Master. This is sorcery. McGreb knows we're coming. I don't think so. He has set traps, but if he were watching us, he'd make certain we'd all be dead. He toys with us. We are but flies in his web. It's possible, but I have to believe that there's a chance to set this right. We have to try. And we all die trying? Just like their wish? Just like... This is all your fault. If you hadn't tried to impress a princess, we'd all be back in Baghdad now, planning our next show. And now my brother is dead because of you. Lena, I'm sorry none of this was supposed to happen. If you're sorry, let's go back. No, before it's too late. We can't do that. We have to finish this. We died to save a woman you imagine you love? He's not the only one. Navina. We are as family. Please. Darwish and Samad, they were my brothers too. You're so... would follow you till the ends of the earth. We all would. But you let us do this. And now they're dead. I'm done. Navina, please. I will not die for her. 
You may follow your heart. Mine has light. I'm going back to Baghdad. Return with me and live or remain and be fools. I'm sorry, Navina. We have to finish this. We have to stop Maghreb. Guards patrolling. When I wish for a palace, I wish for this many guards. I can safely say that's the work of the vizier, I believe. But that window was particularly inviting. A man standing on another man's shoulders should be able to make it without effort. Let's see if that's true. Where's Maghreb keeping the Sultana? This can be hard or easy, my friend. I'm gonna release this gag, and you will give us answers. If you yell, you won't be so gentle this time. Where's the Sultana being held, and what is the feast for? You're the Ark of Vets. Yes. We're here to save the Sultana. She's on the second floor. She's to be married to the Sultan tomorrow. The Sultan? Maghreb. He's made himself Sultan. We have to hurry. And forgive me. Give me that. You know nothing of fighting. I'm learning. We should leave. Quickly. Well, that explains that. I need no rescuer. But I'm pleased that you've made the effort. I could not do nothing. This is all my fault and I have to set it right. Your new honesty is refreshing, Acrobat. I look forward to hearing your tale. It's not quite over yet. That took you long enough. Trouble with the sand traps? <laughs> 
Shazadi, my flower. Consorting with the rabble again. You know, even in Slave's Garden, you're still the most beautiful flower in the garden. However, Jeannie. Much better. Now come. Come sit next to me, my Sultana. I am not your Sultana! <sighs> Jeannie. These cherries are delicious. Your fall from grace is also delicious. Your taste is questionable, Vizier. Sultan. In name only. Without the genie, you're just a little man with a little lizard. Indeed. We shall rectify that scenario. Genie, see to it that my beloved Tanin is a formidable adversary of her the acrobat. Go and be sure that he breathes fire. That should make things more interesting. As thou commands, Master. What were you thinking? I thought he'd fight me himself. If we live through this, I will kill you myself. never understood the office in which you held. The people don't want a friend. They want a ruler. Sultan leaves and punishes as needed. Only a man can know these things. A real man doesn't need a genie to accomplish them. <laughs> Perhaps, but it helps. Over here, you great, big, ugly, belching beast! Substitute for skill. A thousand lashes wouldn't be enough for you!
He never gives up that easily. He is up to something. Gods find him and kill him. You are a serpent made of lies! But never with you, my sweet. Be at ease. This will all be over soon. Such spirit. We will make a perfect match once your soul has blended with the dark ones. <laughs> Genie, fetch me my conjuring bowl and tools. We have a ceremony to perform. Thy wish is my command. I revealed a glimpse of the dark arts to that dunce Aladdin. He understood nothing. Foolish mortal. Yes. Yes, he is. You meant Aladdin? Hmm? But of course, Master. I call to thee, O Dark One. I give you my own life, my devotion is complete. I have offered them your mind and your soul. The rest of you, well, that shall be my reward. You will never <laughs> live to collect it, you swine! Mm. There's that defiant spirit I love so much. We will be a perfect match once it's aligned with mine. What manner of man needs magic to force his will on another? You gave your heart to a peasant. A charm, the likes of which you never gave to me. Is that where this all began? Sad. Boo! My heart was never yours to claim! That sharp tongue shall be the first thing I silence. The Dark Ones bless me with their continents. I am their living vessel. Well, if thou hast such power, what need hast thou for me? The price they exact is a high one. My years shall fade much like the leaves that drift from a tree in the fall. You shall act as my conduit from this day forth to carry out my will so that I may live my years of leisure with her. Dark ones call to you, Shazadi! Stop it, you fool! It's me! McGrath is protected! Destroy the world and save Shazadi. think you've won. Worthless dog. Come claim your reward. Tenny? The dragon's weak spot is his eyes. Go for the eyes! I confess, I am most impressed, acrobat. Few men have had a day such as yours and live to tell the tale. 
Why you wooed a sultana and won her heart. You braved the Cave of Death. Did I mention that's the real name of that cave? You had a genie, the palace, and true love, all in the span of a day. You fought a dragon. All for her. Was it worth it? Perhaps we should ask your friends. You had friends with you when you came in, right? Loyal friends, I recall now. Loyal to the end, I believe the phrase goes. Why, well, they all met their end, helping you find true love. <laughs> I just realized that you're exactly like me. <laughs> Why, you discard and destroy anything and anyone that gets in the way of what you want. <laughs> You could be my son! <laughs> hmm. There's one of your friends. I think I shall hear his screams in my dreams tonight. I know that you will. <laughs> ah! Took you long enough. We go together, Vizier. You've learned nothing, Dalt. Now die, and let me live in peace. Tani! Clearly a mistake hiring an acrobat. Inshallah, guide my hand. Shahzadi gave you a powerful charm that day, acrobat. Genie. Kill him. Yes, master. What is happening? Why does he still live? I, too, am mystified, old master. No charm is that powerful. Yes, and he's also an agile acrobat. Truly, his skill is unparalleled. I am your master. You must obey me. Thy every wish is as a command to me. Now slay this man. Yes, master. Huh. It seems he enjoys favor from above, oh master. Enough! I am the holder of the lamp. I see no lamp. He who holds the lamp commands me. Here now be the lamp that commands you. Ah, yes. The lamp that binds me with its power, never to be sundered. Now remove him from my sight. Yes, Master. At last, never has there been a bigger thorn in my side. You and I have much to discuss, Jimmy. There is no place for friendship in the realm of rule. You're wrong, McGrevin. Friendship is the greatest treasure of all. You still live. A treacherous slave. Kill him and be done with it. No lamp, no master. Fine. <laughs> Yeah. 
friendship. Mm. Well, that knife sure looks like it could use a companion. I hope there's enough life left in you to see what I do to your last friend. How do you imagine you'll be doing with that? This. You came back. I told you you couldn't tie your sashes without me. <laughs> Genie! Come forth! The Dark Ones still favor me, peasants! To the end, you avoid your fate. Dodging things is what I do. <laughs> That's all you've ever been good at. <laughs> As for my pet, <laughs> That's for stealing the lamp. <laughs> and that was for stealing her heart. <sighs> Will there be one for being a better man than you? <laughs> A fitting end to the would-be prince. As you said, we must all embrace our destiny. <laughs> no genie, no friends, no charm, so no magic. Die, acrobat! He's speaking. He sounds confused. <laughs> if he thinks I'm an angel, then he's definitely confused. <laughs> Not yet. My heart. He's been unconscious for many days now. My grab help. Where are we? We're safe. We're home. We're in bed. My grab is no more. You killed him. No. A great wind came and carried him off the cliff. Not a great wind. He had a little push. <laughs> I can let that two-bit sorcerer kill the best friend I ever had. <laughs> Thank you, Murat. My friend. But what of you now? Where will you go? I destroyed the lamp. Wherever I will, former master. I am no longer bound to the lamp. I am pleased. You have earned your freedom. I guess I should be on my way as well. On your way? Home. I do not wish to cause you any further trouble. You are home. For now and forever, I found this. You cause me no trouble. Not now, anyway. <laughs> but I'm not what you think. I am not a prince. I lied to you. You are a prince. In here. All my life I've had every comfort I could ever want or buy, except for the love of a worthy man. You are a worthy man, Aladdin. And as Sultana, I make the law and can marry whomever I choose. 
I choose you. If you'll have me. I suppose. I have no right to refuse the Sultana anything. <laughs> Aladdin? What was the last thing you said to my grip? We must all embrace our destiny. All right, everyone, stand back, stand back. Because I've got a wedding to plan. <laughs> oh.